What's going on? It's Ed here from ClicksGeek, and today we're going to talk about why your ads are not showing up in Google. Uh, on occasion, I get an angry uh, email from client or a panicked phone call. Hey, I uh, just Googled my own stuff and I can't find my ads. What's going on? First things first, stop Googling your own ads, and I'll explain why. When you Google your own ads, and let's assume for a sec you do see your ads, if you don't click on your ads, which of course you're not going to because you'd be nuts to you know click on your own ad and have to pay for your own click that'd be silly so you wouldn't do that right so by not clicking on your ad what you're doing is you're lowering your CTR you're lowering your campaign click-through rate and by doing that you're actually hurting the performance of your campaign and I only did it one time stop lying to yourself no one does this just once everyone does this like at least once a day if you're doing it once a day that's 30 times per month that you're seeing the ad and it didn't click through and it's hurting campaign performance. So that's number one. Stop doing that. Better thing to do is to use the ads preview tool. If you don't know what that is, just Google Google ads preview tool and it'll pop up. And all you got to do is go in and set your geo targeting for your location and do a search and it'll show you what it looks like. That's best practice. Okay. If you are, um, if you're not seeing the ad, so let's say for example, someone else Googled it or whatever, whatever reason, however you came up with the, the fact that your ads are not showing, um, it could be you're not seeing impressions in the campaign or it could be any number of reasons, but there are lots of reasons why your ads potentially would not be showing. And I'm going to walk through a bunch. First is the most common situation, what I just went through. At a certain point, if you're the one searching um, and not clicking the ads, Google starts to realize it's very intelligent and starts to realize that you're the owner of the account and you're just searching for yourself and they're going to stop displaying your ads. Not best situation. You don't want that to happen. So stop doing that, please. You're hurting your own campaign. Um, that's first things first. Another thing to think about is your ads will never appear for 100% of your searches. It just doesn't work that way. You can get pretty close to it, but 100% is very unlikely. Next thing to think about is our golden ratio, which we've talked about a lot on this channel, the Google Ads golden ratio. And that is the ratio of your average click cost to your daily budget. You want that ratio to be as wide as possible, okay? And if it's tight, say, let's say your click cost is 10 bucks and you have $50 a day, that's a one in five ratio, that's a good place to be. But even with that, that means you could realistically only get five clicks per day. So of that, how many more times can you realistically be shown that day? without blowing through your budget and tomorrow's budget and the next day's budget, okay? So Google starts to throttle you. You have to look at your click cost, your daily budget, and then the overall daily search volume of the market, okay? And put all things into consideration. You're never going to appear for all searches, and you have to be realistic based on what your daily budget is compared to your click cost, compared to what the overall uh, search volume is, you know, looking like on a day-to-day -day basis and a week-over-week -week basis for your niche, okay? That's like macro-level stuff. Then you can go down to micro-level stuff. Another thing common is, let's say your bid is too high and your daily budget's lower than your bid. By default, you're not going to be shown, right? You're bidding too high compared to your budget. That's one another thing. Uh, another thing could be you're bidding too low where your ads just can't get the traction to get up into that top four. Another instance could be negative keywords, blocking. So you've got stuff blocking stuff that you're actively trying to go after. A lot of time that's going to come up and you'll get a notification for conflicting keywords in there or conflicting negative keywords, um, but sometimes it doesn't catch that and that could be an issue. Um, it could be a device bidding issue. It could be a mobile issue versus desktop or tablet. Um, it could be... Perhaps a payment didn't go through. Um, it could be that your ads are uh, disapproved. It could be that your ads are under review. There's literally like tons and tons and tons of reasons why it might happen. In our situation, what we see the most is what I went through first. That's assuming you've set everything up correctly. And that's assuming you've gone through the Google Ads magic formula. You've, got, you've targeted the right keywords. You're writing compelling ad copy. You're sending the traffic to a uh, page that's going to convert at a high rate. That's the magic formula. You're following the Google Ads golden ratio, which is um, a, your average click cost to your daily budget. You want that ratio to be enough so that you can get multiple clicks per day. 
And as long as those two are in, in play, it's likely that Google has stopped showing you the ads because you're searching a lot or um, uh, you're just, you just don't have the budget in place in order to get enough exposure. And it just happened to be one of those times where um, Google wasn't serving your ads. So there's a lot of different things. What I'm going to do is drop this uh, two links in the description here. One is a support link from Google that'll go over a bunch of different uh, scenarios. And the next is an article from WordStream that I really like that outlines, I think it's 10 or 11 or 12 reasons why you're potentially not showing up and uh, giving examples of what to do and what to look for. So I think those would be helpful as well. Um, I'll also drop a link to um, our stuff in the description. Uh, my name is Ed, one of the founders of ClicksGeek. We're a Google Premier Partner Agency. We build and manage Google Ad campaigns for local service businesses, and we also white label for agencies. And we also have courses uh, teaching people how to build and manage Google Ad campaigns, landing pages, how to get digital marketing clients, all that kind of good stuff. If any of that's of interest, links are going to be in the description. Um, and that's it for today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, you know what to do. Drop a comment below if I missed anything or didn't uh, say something you thought I should have said or whatever. That's it. I hope you have a great day and I will see you guys later. Bye.